Well, game didn't go in our favor last night, did they? Well, got that out down and let's talk about it. Go Hello and welcome to this video. You could like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Much appreciate it. Liking helps the algorithm. Share and get to front people's face and subscribe and let people know you like the channel. Hit that notification bell to let you know when videos go live. Memberships are available on the channel. The first one came out this um, week. Uh, done a trucking stream. I do. It's interesting. Um, but yeah, not a great one last night, was it? Really, when you think about it, we need a result to go for us. And they didn't. Um, very slim mathematical chance we can do it, but I can't see it. I cannot see Plymouth or Ipswich dropping points from the la from the last two games. I just don't see it. So we have to dust ourselves down and get ready for playoffs. And that'll be the whole situation. It's been a very tight league, and it was it was those things. We had it in our hands, and we just didn't do it. Um, I'm going to just, just say, until the playoffs is done and everything like that, or whatever happens, I don't think it's the time to start, like, questioning uh, management and all that kind of stuff, because the once you get in the playoffs, it's a lottery. It's a massive lottery that can happen next. I understand people are frustrated. I understand people are angry. I understand that beginning of um, February time, near February time, it looks like we're all, all set. Big, massive uh, capitulation. We've not coped well with it. The other teams have managed to pick up points really quickly. Uh, we haven't. I think it's 13 out of 30 or something like that we picked up. And the others have been in, in like the mid-20s. Picking points out of 30. That's, that's how it goes. So we have to back them. We have to back the lads and we will. We will have fans. We will back the lads. We will get behind them and get our way into thinking that way. Um, having Josh Windath back is good. Um, would you risk him over the next two games? Would you leave him and just have him ready for playoffs? Uh, would you wrap him up in cotton wool? Would you do it with a couple of others? I don't know. It's going to be really interesting to see what when they do next in the next couple of days because... Once this is done, we've got a bit of pre-season, uh, not pre-season, we've got a bit of season stuff to do, and then we prepare for playoffs. We go again. And that's the thing, we go again. We're just going to start well, go for it, and see what happens. And we are just going to, like I said, back the boys, get behind them, and hopefully we get through to a final, but... We gotta get the semi final that way. So at the moment it's looking like it's Derby. Uh at the current moment in time. But who knows? Because hang on, let me have a look at the table. Because the result didn't go well for Bolton last night, because they drew. Uh no, they lost, I think. They lost to uh they didn't drew, they, I think they lost that because Stanley. So it's Derby on seventy five points in six. Posh are on seventy three points in seven, and Bolton are on 75 points as well. So at the moment of um, talking about this, it is currently Derby County we would be playing. But it's very tight to who gets that sixth and fifth spot now because it just, it throw, it thrown a bit of caution to it kind of thing. And just, you just look at the table though, Plymouth 32 goal difference. We're on 40, but they're on, they've got 95 points. And then you look at it, so it's 60 goal difference, 94 points. It, it just makes you feel a little bit sick. I'm not going to lie. Uh, but that's football. It happens. We have to dust ourselves down and we go again. Uh, win the next two games. Make sure we've got a good point total and go into the mini like second half of the season in terms of playoffs. So... Yeah, let me know what you think, but uh, I, I kind of already know what you're going to say and how people are going to be, but we just have to start again. I'm trying to look positive, even though a lot of people might think there isn't a positive to look at, but hey. 